The year is 2018, and NBA commissioner Adam Silver is about to make a lot of dreams a reality. A lot of young kids want to play professional sports, but only a small percentage of the population get that opportunity. So in the NBA, traditionally, we see 60 different names get called, but only a fraction of those 60 people actually get to attend the NBA draft. For a lot of people, sitting in the green room lasts a couple minutes, and for others, it can last hours. But getting the invitation to that green room is a huge, huge moment because A, the NBA determined that you were one of the top people in this draft, and B, you get to get off a of fit. And we've seen good fits, bad fits, and fits that didn't age with time. But one thing that has been consistent no matter what is seeing these athletes use the inside of their coat jacket to represent something. Some people use it to show the flag of the country that they were born. Some people use it to show love to the college that they just attended. And some people use it to promote the biggest game in the world right now. The New York Knicks select Kevin Knox from the University of Kentucky. <laughs> This is now guaranteed that Kevin oh, Knox is wow. going to have an all-star NBA career. It's been five years, and I cannot stop thinking about the fact that this man wore a Fortnite jacket to the biggest night of his life. I always asked why. Was he just like the rest of us, a huge Fortnite fan in the moment? Well, he might have been a fan, but he definitely wasn't good. Either way, this moment will be engraved in NBA history forever. And it might be the thing that we remember the most when we look back on Kevin Knox's career. But I'm here to remind you that that's Summer League. The 2018 Summer League, Kevin Knox was him. I mean, after Zion did this to him. Blew it inside. Robinson tapped it out to Knox. Zion rips it. Punches it home. So he took an L with the Fortnite jacket, and then Zion just ripped the ball out of his hands. He gets back on track, I promise. Because in the few summer league games he played, he averaged 23.3 points, 7.3 rebounds, 2 assists, and a steal and a half. And though he was putting up crazy numbers, even he knew that translating that to the NBA was going to be hard. And if you was watching some of these plays, you would have thought that Kevin Knox was about to be a star in the making. He looked generational. He was drafted to be a shooter, but in Summer League, he wanted to showcase to the world, I'm athletic and I can dunk on your head. I'm not a conspiracy theorist, but if you look to see when Summer League was, you will see that Fortnite Season 5 started right in the middle of Summer League. That is peak Fortnite. That was peak Kevin Knox. And as Fortnite started to fall, so did Kevin Fort Knox. And now in 2023, we saw Kevin Knox suit up for his fourth team in five seasons. And I believe if Fortnite gets back popping, so will Kevin Knox. I'm never getting braids, bro. I'm